For 92-year-old Don Pinciotti, every day at work is like a trip down memory lane. It takes me back. It takes me back to the old days, how baseball was played. His days as a sports memorabilia collector started smack dab in the middle of his career as a minor league baseball player in the 1940s. In fact, Pinciotti still owns the first set of baseball cards he ever bought. I was looking through some cards and all of a sudden I see about seven or eight guys I played with. And I said, oh my God, I, I'll buy them. Those cards aren't for sale at his store inside the Maumee Antique Mall, but other items that he's gathered over the years are. Sporting news here, then I have signed footballs, the helmets I have here, El John Elway, John Elway there. There's Tony Gwynn. Number one, it's history, and number two, it's worth a lot of money. <laughs> At 92, Don says he sells not because he has to, but because he wants to. He says it keeps him young, and it gets all this stuff out of the house. It's a hobby. I mean, a lot of people have hobbies. And when you have a hobby at 92, it keeps me alive. Making the sale is great, but for Pinciotti, nothing tops a conversation about the good old days. It's the meeting of people, talking to people about baseball, and it keeps me going. As they say, the past is in the past. Unless, of course, it's presently on sale for $250 at Pinciotti's store. Mike Lissette, T Sports.